It is video you truly have to see to believe. Surveillance video shows a man luring someone's cat from their front yard. When he finally picks it up, he violently flings the cat into his pickup truck. That thing's so wrong, somebody doing something like that, throwing that animal in there and, you know, have no care about its uh, well-being or anything. That right there is the owner of Thor. Tonight, he just wants his beloved pet returned. KPRC 2's Jonathan Martinez is live from spring. And Jonathan, for any pet lover, it's hard to imagine who could be behind such a disturbing act. Yeah, Lauren, this one really is a tough one. That family tells us their cat was underneath one of their cars here last night when all of a sudden an unknown man pulled up to the front of their driveway, grabbed their cat, threw it inside the truck, and took off. What that man probably was not counting on, though, home surveillance set up that caught it all on camera. We're just praying that, it, that uh, he's all right. I, I hope he is. It's home surveillance video that's hard to watch. A family's cat stolen, they say, from their driveway and violently flung into a truck by an unknown man. Somebody knows this guy, you know, and it seems like the way he did that, it looks like he's done this stuff before. The 13-year-old cat's name is Thor, and Don Saul says he's more than just a pet. The family is now heartbroken at the thought of not having him or knowing what happened to him. The cat's like my family member, you know, and uh, I don't know what I would do. It's just it's pretty upsetting. Saul says making matters worse, in the video there appears to be another animal inside the truck when his cat was stolen. When he gets out of his vehicle, you can see uh, eyes moving in the vehicle. I mean, there was a dog inside that inside that truck. The family has since filed a report with the Montgomery County Precinct 3 Constable's Office in an effort to find their cat. Animals an animal and they should none of them should be treated in that kind of a manner. They're also hoping someone will recognize the man or his truck in the surveillance video to help get Thor back home. It's just a sad situation and I, I want, I'd certainly like the person that did that to pay for what they've done. And if you know anything about this case, you're urged to contact the Montgomery County Precinct 3 Constable's Office. We're reporting live tonight from Spring. I'm Jonathan Martinez, KPRC 2 News. Oh, it's tough to watch that video.